In this video, we will be seeking answers to the questions that everybody is thinking, but no one dares ask. Yes, it is perfectly safe to charge your electric car in the rain because not a single person has ever been electrocuted by plugging their car in to a charge point. Not a single person. One, because both the charge point and the car will have to talk to each other to ensure there's nothing up before any charge starts flowing. And two, because the car and indeed the cables are shrouded in layers of protection, which means that they won't get wet or dirty or otherwise conduct electricity when they shouldn't do. There's only one problem here and that's because you said this water would be warm. I hate you. Well, let's think about what happens when a petrol or a diesel runs out of fuel. It stops. But actually, you'll get lots of warnings before that happens in an electric vehicle. And generally, a lot of them will show you what's going on and they'll maybe actually drop into a special range saving mode that lets you eke out that last couple of miles so that you can get somewhere safe or find an appropriate plug. But let's face it, electric cars are exactly like a petrol or diesel in that if you don't put the stuff in them that makes them go, they'll stop. Hello, is that a green flag? Ginny? Yeah? I think electric cars are making me fat. Go on then. Well, you know, I have to do a lot of charging because I'm driving electric cars a lot. Mm -hmm. Well, then inevitably means I'll buy a coffee and then I have to buy a cake because cake. God, that's really easy. Just. Go for a walk. Check your emails like I do. Use your time constructively. You are literally browsing Instagram reels. Like I said, constructively. Also, you know, you could just exercise some self-control. Hmm. What do you like? A low-calorie black Americano. Just say black Americano. Caramel latte, please. OK, cream on it. Don't do, don't do it. Yes, please. Uh, would you like anything else? Don't order cake. Don't order cake. Yeah, chocolate muffin. All right. And for you? Oh, just um, hot water with some lemon, please. No! Strangely, this is a question that we get asked quite a lot here at Electrifying. And the simple answer is yes you can put an electric car through a car wash. In fact, they're just as waterproof as any petrol or diesel motor. In fact, if you could seal up an electric car, you could possibly, in theory, drive one underwater. I'm not gonna try that though. And that's how you drive an electric car through a car wash. Scare stories are always popular, aren't they? But that is all they are. A properly installed home wall box draws the same sort of power as an electric hooker. So most houses will be absolutely fine. Now, most electric cars plug into a charging point which sits on a separate circuit and that has plenty of protection and fuses. So even if you switch on the kettle, the toaster, the tumble dryer and the telly all at once, intelligent power management will just mean that the car slows down its charging until the full power is available again. Now, some older houses might need electrical upgrades, but that is pretty rare. So there you go, absolutely nothing to worry about. In fact, some electric cars can only be charged by using a domestic three-pin plug. Like this one, the Citroen Ami. I know, but it's so cute. It just feels a bit mean to leave it outside on its own at night.
This is widely known as a charging bay being iced, which means that it's been occupied by some uncaring soul driving a car with an internal combustion engine. If you're in a place where you can report it, then do so, because there might be an embarrassing tannoy that can be used. With the person driving the black BMW that's parked in the electric charging bay, please move it because you are an embarrassment to your family and your whole nation. But what I tend to do is just leave a very kind note. But generally, you just have to remain calm, let it pass you by, and remain zen.